It is. Morning, everyone. Morning, I wanted, morning, Steve. I wanted to introduce everybody to a special guest we have uh, this morning. This is Mary D. Williams, one of the finest gospel singers in the world. Whoa. I did not know she was going to be able to spend the night with us. Elsewise, I would have put the pressure on her and had her provide some of the music. Absolutely. Oh, yes. Okay. But Mary has, I'm telling you, the voice of the female God. I'm telling you, she could make these walls reverberate. <laughs> Boy. Well, Mary, if you will sing for us, we can forgo anything that I have sent today. So it's not a problem. I'm, I'm always able. Oh, okay. no problem. No problem. No problem. Let's, put, let's put her on instead of that first one for sure. And then if you feel like singing a second for us, go for it. Okay. Outstanding. Good morning, Ray Kennedy. Uh, we're doing something on our own this morning. Improvise. <laughs> Steve Coggins, the producer. <laughs> it's time to get started. Good morning and welcome to morning prayer. Um, this is Tuesday of the second week of Easter. Um, after opening sentences, we'll continue with the invitatory on page 80 in the Book of Common Prayer. Hallelujah, yeah. Christ is risen. The oh, Lord is Lord risen, is risen indeed. indeed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thanks yeah. be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, open our lips. And our, and our mouth shall Lord, proclaim your praise. Your praise. Glory, Glory to, to the, the Father, Father and, and to the Son, Spirit, and to the Holy Spirit, as the beginning, as the is, now, the beginning is, is now, and will be forever. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Christ, our Passover, uh, on page 83, please repeat the Alleluia whenever you hear one. Alleluia. 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 Christ, our Passover, has been sacrificed for us. Therefore, let us keep the feast, not with the old leaven, the leaven of malice and evil, but with the unleavened bread of sincerity and truth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Christ, being raised from the dead, will never die again. Death no longer has dominion over him. The death that he died, he died to sin once for all. But the life he lives, he lives to God. So also consider yourselves dead to sin and alive to God in Jesus Christ, our Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Christ has been raised from the dead, the first fruits of those who have fallen asleep. For since by a man came death, by a man has also has come also the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all die, so in Christ shall all be made alive. Hallelujah. 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 The Psalms for today are Psalms 5 and 6, beginning at page 588 in the prayer book. In the prayer book. We'll recite them responsibly, alternating at the aspect. Okay. Page 588, Psalm 5. Give ear to my words, O Lord. Consider my meditation. my meditation. Hearken to my cry for help, my King and my God. For I make, for I make, I make my, my prayer, prayer to you. you. In the morning, Lord, you hear my voice. Early in the morning, 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 I make my appeal and watch for you. you. For you are not a God who takes pleasure in wickedness. And evil, and evil cannot dwell on you. Braggarts cannot stand in your sight. You, you paint all, the, all those who work, work wickedness. wickedness. You destroy those who speak lies. The bloodthirsty, bloodthirsty and deceitful, O Lord, poor. But as for me, through the greatness of your mercy, I will go into your house. I will, I will bow down to the temple, temple and call of you. Of you. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness. Because you lie and wait for me. Make your way straight, for, your way straight for, me. for me. For there is no truth in their mouth. 
there, there is, there is destruction, destruction in their, in their heart. heart. Their throat is an open <laughs> They flatter with their tongue. tongue. Declare them guilty, O oh God. Let them Let fall, them fall because, because of their schemes. Because of their many transgressions, cast them out. For they have rebelled, they have rebelled against, against you. Him. But all who take refuge in you will be glad. They will, they sing, will sing out, sing out, out their, their joy, joy forever. forever. They, you will shelter them. So, so that those, that those who love, love your name may exalt in you. For you, O oh Lord, will bless the righteous. You will defend, you will defend them, them with, with your favor, favor as with a shield. shield. Psalm 6. Lord, do not rebuke me in your anger. Do not punish, not punish me in your wrath. Have pity on me, Lord, for I am weak. Heal me, Lord, 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 my, my bones are racked. My spirit shakes with terror. How long, O Lord, how long? How long? Turn, O Lord, and deliver me. Save me, me for, for your mercy's sake. sake. For in death no one remembers you. And who, to who will give you thanks in the grave? Life. I grow weary because of my groaning. Every night, Every night I, I drench, night drench night my bed and, and flood, flood my couch, my couch with, with tears. tears. My eyes are wasted with grief and, and walk away, away because, because of all my enemies. enemies. Depart from me, all evildoers. For the, Lord the Lord has heard the sound of my weeping. The Lord has heard my supplication. The Lord, the Lord accepts, accepts my, my prayer. prayer. <laughs> all my enemies shall be confounded and quake with fear. They shall they run should back and back, back and suddenly be put to shame. shame. Glory to the, the Father, Father and to the Son, and, Son, and, and to the, the Holy, Holy Spirit, Spirit as, as that was, was in the beginning, beginning is, is now, and will be, and will be forever. forever. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. 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 Today's scriptures will be read by Freddie, and after the first lesson, we'll have some wonderful surprise music. <laughs> um, I invite you to mute until the end of the Apostles' Creed. First, letting, first lesson, you're reading from the book of Daniel. In the second year of Nebuchadnezzar's reign, Nebuchadnezzar dreamed such dreams that his spirit was troubled and his sleep left him. So the king commanded that the musicians, the enchanters, the sorcerers, and the Chaldeans be summoned to tell the king his dreams. When they came in and stood before the king, he said to them, I have had such a dream that my spirit is troubled by the desire to understand it. The Chaldeans said to the king in Aramaic, O king, live forever. Tell your servants the dream, and we will reveal the interpretation. The king answered the Chaldeans, This is a public decree. If you do not, if you do not tell me both the dream and its interpretation, you shall be torn limb from limb and your houses shall be laid in ruins. But if you do tell me the dream and its interpretation, you shall, you shall receive from me gifts and rewards and great honor. Therefore, tell me the dream and its interpretation. They answered a second time. Let the king first tell his servants the dream, then we can give its interpretation. The king answered, I know with certainty that you're trying to gain time, because you see I have firmly decreed. <clears throat> If you do not tell me the dream, there is but one verdict for you. You have agreed to speak lying and misleading words to me until things take a turn. Therefore, tell me the dream, and I shall know that you can give me its interpretation. The Chaldeans answered the king, there is no one on earth who can reveal what the king demands. In fact, no king, however great and powerful, has ever asked such a thing of any magician or enchanter or Chaldean. The thing that the king is asking is too difficult, and no one can reveal it to the king except the gods, whose dwelling is not with mortals. Because of this, the king flew into a violent rage and commanded that all the wise men of Babylon be destroyed. The decree was issued, and the wise men were about to be executed, and they looked for Daniel and his companions to execute them. Then Daniel responded with prudence and discretion to Arioch, the king's chief chief executioner, who had gone out to ex execute the wise men of Babylon. He asked Arioch, the royal official, 
Why is the decree of the king so urgent? Arioch then explained the matter to Daniel. So Daniel went in and requested that the king give him time. He would tell the king the interpretation. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Tis so sweet to trust in Jesus, just to take him at his word, just to rest upon his promise just to know the same lord jesus jesus how i trust him how I prove him over and over, Jesus, Jesus, precious Jesus, oh, for the grace to trust. I got to follow that. Can we just end the service right here? <laughs> Second lesson, a reading from the first letter of John. <clears throat> My little ch children, I am writing these things to you so, that you so that you may not sin. But if anyone does sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ the righteous. And he is the atoning sacrifice for our sins. And not for ours only, but also the sins of the whole world. Now by this we may be sure that we know him, if we obey his commandments. Whoever says, I have come to know him, but does not obey his commandments, is a liar. And, and in such a person, the truth does not exist. But whoever obeys his word, truly is the, this person the love of God has reached perfection. By this we may be sure that we are in him. Whoever says, I abide in him, ought to walk just as he walked. Beloved, I am writing you with no new commandment, but an old commandment that you have had time from the beginning. The old commandment is the word that you have heard. Yet I am writing you with a new commandment that is true in him and in you, because the darkness is passing away and the true light is already shining. Whoever says, I am in the light, while hating a brother or sister, is still in the darkness. Whoever loves a brother or sister lives in the light, and in such a person there is no cause for stumbling. Whoever hates another believer is in the darkness, walks in the darkness, and does not know the way to go, because the darkness has brought on blindness. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Let us affirm our faith in the words of the Apostles' Creed on page 96. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. The prayers are on page 97. Begin using the translation of the Lord's Prayer on the right. The Lord be with you. And, and also, also with you. you. Let us pray. Our Father, Father in heaven, Lord in heaven, be your name. Lord be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will, your will be, done. be done. 
on, on earth, earth as in as heaven. In heaven. Give, give us, us today, today our daily bread. Forgive, forgive us, us our sins, sins as, as we forgive, forgive those who sin against us. us. And save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, the glory, the glory are yours, now and forever. And forever. Amen. Amen. Show us your mercy, O Lord, and grant, and grant us your salvation. Clothe your ministers with righteousness. Let your, let your people sing with joy. Give peace, O Lord, in all the world. Growing and we live in safety. safety. Lord, keep this nation under your care. And guide us in us the way of justice and truth. Let your way be known upon earth. Your saving, saving health among all nations. Let not the needy, O Lord, be forgotten. Nor the hope, or the hope of, of the poor be taken away. away. Create in us clean hearts, O God. And sustain and us with your Holy Spirit. O God, you have united diverse peoples in the confession of your name. Grant that all who have been born again in the font of baptism may also be united in faith and love. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Let your people, O Lord, rejoice forever that they have been renewed in spirit and let the joy of your adoption of our adoption as your sons and daughters strengthen the hope of our glorious resurrection in Jesus Christ our Lord amen amen amen, amen. and Lord God almighty for no merit on our part you have brought us out of death into life out of joy sorrow into joy put no end to your gifts Fulfill your marvelous acts in us and grant to us who have been justified by faith the strength to persevere in that faith through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. O Lord, you open the portals of your kingdom to those who have been reborn by water and the Spirit. Increase the grace you have given to your children that those whom you have cleansed from sin may attain to all promises through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. 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 Almighty God, whose son Jesus Christ in his earthly life shared us our toil and hallowed our labor, be present with your people where they work. Make those who carry on the industries and commerce of this land responsive to your will. Give to us all a pride in what we do and a just return for our labor. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. 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 <clears throat> Prayers of the people. In this season of resurrection, we lift up to God all those in need in the church and throughout the world. Renew your church. Give us courage to bring your good news into a world in need of healing. Risen Lord, hear our, our, our prayer. Renew our world. Guide those who shape our economies and systems of government so that all have the opportunity to work and share your abundant resources. Grant meaningful and secure labor to those seeking employment. Risen Lord, hear our, our prayer. prayer. Renew your creation. Challenge us to use resources wisely, generously, and respectfully. Risen Lord, hear our prayer. prayer. Renew our concern for humanity. For thrift stores, rummage sales, craft fairs, and outreach ministries which serve the needs of those in financial insecurity. For food banks and pantry for soup kitchens and community meal programs, serving those with food insecurity or nutritional needs. Risen Lord, hear our prayer. prayer. Renew our congregation, equip our clergy and staff, wardens and vestry and members and seekers with a sense of purpose to serve the wider community. Risen Lord, 
Hear our, Hear our prayer. prayer. Renew within your right, renew within us your spiritual gifts. Transform our thanks into compassion for those who are poor in body, mind, or spirit. Risen Lord, hear our, hear our prayer. prayer. Renew us in hope. Bring us together at the last with St. James of Jerusalem, our patron, all the saints, and all the faithful departed. Risen Lord, hear, hear, our, hear our prayer. prayer. Into your care, O oh God, we place ourselves and all our prayers, trusting your promise of new life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. 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 Almighty God, you know the needs of your church in every place. Thank you for looking graciously upon St. James Parish and for the Holy Spirit's guidance as we have moved through the search process for our new rector. Thank you for the faithful stewards you have provided for our leadership, and especially for the ministry of clergy, staff, and vestry throughout this transition period. We are so grateful that this season of mutual discernment led us to Philip Craig, and that he has accepted the call to become St. James Rector. Please protect Philip and his family as they navigate the logistics of a cross-country move. Prepare us to welcome Philip and to provide him with the support he needs as he begins this new role. You, Lord, are the good shepherd who has shepherded us, us during this journey. And for that, we give you thanks and praise. Amen. 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 We offer prayers for those known to us in our community. And after the reading of the names, you may share your own prayers aloud or list them in the chat column. Dear Lord, we pray for Dave, James, Laura Cope, Missy Wright, Jocelyn, William, Mary Ann, Jenny, Bob, and Cheryl. We pray for Sally, Joel, and Dwayne, for Mary's upcoming eye surgery, for Fran, Bill and Kathy, for Erica, for Adriana, Emmanuel, for Heather, Jane, Carol, Susan, Aaron, and Glenda, for Francis Hagen and Melissa, Ford Bobbick, Kevin, the people of Minneapolis, for Francie and Steve, for Teresa, for Peter, Eve, David, Sybil, and myself, Janet, for Cheryl's back and for Cheryl, for Michael, for BJ, for Dana, for Wright and Eileen, for Carl, and for John. Are there other prayer requests at this time? Pray for Lyndall. For Brenda and Gail and Kit. about Thanksgivings. After hearing the prayers this morning, I'm suspicious we have thankfulness for Susan's ability with words. You are so right. <laughs> yes. I'm thankful for my new expanded family. We've gone from three to seven with another one expected in November. Oh, wow. Oh. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that music. Oh my goodness. Thank oh yeah. You. Yes, absolutely absolutely thank you yeah. more to come if you want yes right. absolutely wow. <laughs> i'm thankful for this gorgeous day mm -hmm. oh my god yes yes and for the work on my house that you may hear from time to time <laughs> <laughs> okay oh i'm thankful for a picture i received from Janet, I may have to throw something on the screen with a red hat one day. <laughs> oh, please. I didn't get permission yet, but it's worth a view. No. I love it. Okay, Beth is going to lead us in the general Thanksgiving on page 101. 
Almighty God, Father of all mercies, we, your unworthy servants, give you humble thanks for all your goodness and loving kindness mm -hmm. to us and to all whom you have made. We bless you for our creation, preservation, and all the blessings of this life, but above all for your immeasurable love in the redemption of the world by our Lord Jesus Christ and for the means of grace and for the hope of glory. And we pray, give us such an awareness of your mercies that with truly thankful hearts, we may show forth your praise, not only with our lips, but in our lives by giving up ourselves to your service and by walking before you in holiness and righteousness all our days through Jesus Christ, our Lord, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit be all be honor and glory all through the all throughout all ages. Amen. 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 Jenny, you were muted. Sorry. We'd love some more music. Mm -hmm. Amazing grace. Ah, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Ah, <laughs> thank you oh what a so treat beautiful. oh wow thank you holy and sovereign lord when the earth and all its people quake you hold its pillars firm what is uncertain and frightening to us is completely known to you and controlled by you look mercifully on the people of saint james and other parishes represented here Although at this time we are apart from each other, we pray your Holy Spirit will unite us as one. Pour upon us your peace, which passes all understanding. Keep us safe and healthy, and above all, 
Keep us mindful of those to whom we should show the love and compassion of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Let us bless the Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. Thanks, Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Alleluia, alleluia. alleluia. Glory to God, whose power working in us can do infinitely more than we can imagine, ask, or imagine. Glory to him from generation to generation in the church and in Christ Jesus forever and ever. Amen. 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 Thank you. Thank what you, a special Mary. morning prayer. Thank you, Mary. And yes. thank you, Mary. Thank yes, you. yes, that was lovely. absolutely. Glad right. you were here today, and it's so good to see everybody. Thank you for your prayers. I feel them, and I'm grateful. Um, Wednesday, eleven o'clock. Um, we're crossing the Jordan River, so join us for Bible study. And if you would like an instructed morning prayer, we're doing Walk in Love on Thursday night at 7. So all of our classes are starting back this week. So good to see everybody. Thank you, Cheryl. Good to see everybody. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. God bless.